know damn well Tom Brady ain't about to get on there on that camera on that stage and be like, yeah, it's time for a change. Eli Manning ain't gonna do it. Brad Favre ain't gonna do it. Don't none of them talk about this shit. Don't no white athletes. I ain't heard no white athletes come on there and be like, oh yeah, you know what? Yeah, that was wrong what happened to them. That was wrong. Nah, I ain't even heard Kevin Love say nothing. <laughs> so when people people write when they say that these just these black athletes doing it alone ain't gonna work. It could, but it ain't gonna work. Because it's probably somebody right now saying, fuck that nigger and what he said last night. So I get what they say when it gotta be a collective group of people coming together, not just no all all Aboriginal people. All Aboriginal people been getting shitted on since the beginning of time. Or not since the beginning of time, since the beginning of uh, Europeans coming and capturing their land. So when you want to when you want to say Tom Brady step up and say something he's still going to, about flattening balls and stuff he don't care about he don't care about them people getting shot Tom Brady can care less about that cuz it ain't got nothing to do with his legacy see then you got Michael Jordan he ain't care about it cuz he said Republicans they buy my shoes so Michael Jordan don't care so that's why I say fuck Michael Jordan I don't care what nobody say when it come to aboriginal we still aboriginals Mike so Fuck Michael Jordan, for real. And people that stand in line, die for his shoes, fuck him. He won't even stand up like that shit, Mark. Malcolm X, Muhammad Ali, Martin Luther King. Well, I'm really pointing at Muhammad Ali. You won't even stand up for me. I don't care if you're a Republican. You won't even stand up for me for my rights. I don't care if you respect that I box. I don't care if you buy my poster. You won't stand up for me for my rights and my religious beliefs. You hear me? Let's go, Jim Brown. This dude, what's his name? Uh, 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 Charles Barkley get on there talking and stuff. First off, y'all got all this money and still don't know who we are. You don't know from reading that we are called half originals. We're not black. That's a business. Being black is a business, man, and they took them people and they use them as cattle, just as the same as the people that's like when you can be traded in the NBA and somebody can have control over you in the sports world, people have control over you in the same world that's not the sports world before you enter the sports world. So when you're not telling these people who they are, of course, they're going to keep making the same mistakes because you're not tuning them into their heritage, man. We are Ab original people. We are not Black Lives Matter. We are Ab originals, man. That means the first, the origin of the people. So when you come to that, then you will know. But that's why Tom Brady, it ain't Tom Brady's job to keep saying this. It's not, it's not uh, Jack Nicholson's job. It's not none of them European jobs to tell you who you are. It's your job to read. So when you encourage reading and you encourage heritage, then the people can know who they are. Maybe they'll stop and calm down. But when you're still promoting that they're black and they're not black, look at me. Look at me. We're not black. It's not, I'm, I'm not mad that you're calling me black. I'm mad that you don't know that black is a color. It don't, it, it, it refers to a color, a hue, a darkened hue, or whatever. But we are the ad original people, man. And we are been we have been corrupt. Our villages have been taken over. None of them is talking about this. None of the, none of the sports athletes, even when you step up, even when you step up and be like, oh yeah, this has to stop. The, sh the going back and forth has to stop. But you gotta get to the root of the problem. That's what root means. When you get to the root. That's the ground problem. The ground problem is the people don't know who they are. They're not even being taught who they are in school. They're being taught that they're the they're the uh, the slaves that came over here from Africa, and then now everybody is just African. But if you look, the color of law, police officers, black male. I can be an Englishman right now. My heritage can be uh, European, and you talking about I'm a black man. 
That's putting everybody into one title. But the problem with the people in America is that they don't know. The, 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 the aboriginal people do not know that they are the original people. The, the, the people that you call black in America do not know that they are the aboriginal people. Now go look up these congressmen and people that make a mistake and say the aborigines or the, the aborigines. Of course Tom Brady not going to say nothing. So that's a stupid statement to say you want to see Tom Brady say something. Why? Why? What, what's that going to do? I get what you're saying. Maybe it'll get somebody else to start thinking. But European people or, or Caucasian people, they can't think for themselves. They can't read for themselves all the time. If they had to read when we couldn't read for 400 years when it was illegal for us to read. Look in the Webster's 1828 with American men. Come on, man. This ain't nobody trying to. I'm not one of them people that be like, oh, uh, fuck the white people. Fuck the. I don't even think they're white. They're not white. Just like I'm not black. I came across brown people or copper color people. But that's still a color, man. And when you're dealing with business, when you're dealing with illegal stuff, then, uh, oh, when you're dealing with the color of law, then you got black, brown, white, and indigo people and stuff like that. But when you're dealing with natural flesh and blood human beings, then you're dealing with aboriginals. You're dealing with tribes, man. When people don't know what tribe they belong to, what heritage they come from, of course, a lot of their answers can never, questions can never be answered because guess what? You don't even know who you are. You're just being someone who, who they, who they, who they basically made you to be and controlled you to be. Because when you look, they like the Indians doing with some of the toughest people. Because guess what? When you come over here and you try to take our shit, we are gonna, excuse my language, we are gonna mess you up. Now people want it to be a race war, but guess what? Guess what? Why do you need a race war? When how can? Let, let me ask this. How can Donald Trump tell somebody that he trying to get them? to go back home. And there's a lot of European people here that need to go back home. They, they came and took this land. Like, like what? I, I don't know. And guess what? They operate in fraudulently. Fraudulently, or however you say it, man. Fraudulently. Fraudulently, however. But they operate in fraudulently in your land, man. And that's the problem. When people don't want to say, or uh, what the actual problem is, of course we're going to keep having this happen. Of course we're going to have 137 shots and then nobody convicted. Of course we're going to have officers be able to ride up on the kid with a gun and say, oh, my tactics. You don't got no, they like a lot of people, Charles Barkley, a lot of people Monday night quarterbacking. You sound like an op, Charles. My parents is police, man. You sound like an op, man, when you say, oh, my, uh, uh, I'm not going to, a lot of people are Monday night quarterbacking. You don't ride up to no, don't nobody, unless you was going to hit this kid with the car, don't nobody just roll up to no kid and get up. When you hear that they got a fucking gun, man, that's some dumb shit. And then you get off. This world is fucked up, man. So let me tell you, when the people don't know who they are, of course we're going to keep failing, man. We're going to keep not going to where we need to go, and we're not going to ever get to where we need to get because the people are hiding who you really are. Hidden colors, they ain't say, oh, yeah, they, they showed you, like, oh, yeah, this, that, and the third, but they ain't get to the bottom of it because guess what? You're not a black man. You're not. That a black man was not everybody. A black man was certain people found in Africa. Some people were actually different. What they call it? What they call it? Different heritages, huh? Different, different, different races. Come on, man. But it's still just a human race, though, huh? Come on, man. Come on. Tell the people who they are, man. Black lives matter. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go, man. I'm talking about this dude. Come on there. I'm talking about something. It just, it just really aggravated me, y'all, because they not telling the people. Who they are, and they could be trying to start a race war. And you're like, well, why? I haven't talked to millions of European people that's aware of what I'm talking about. And they'd be like, yeah, well, we know we took this land. Our people, our ancestors, they took this land, and we basically tried to take over your all stuff. And now we created a system that you weren't a part of. But now somehow, because of Martin Luther King and them, you guys got a part of it. And now <laughs> we can do whatever we want to you, any type of way we want. Come on, man, wake up. Wake up.